Hi everyone, today we are going to come back to talking about turnout a little bit because, well, it's important to um, be able to, to do it properly. Now, turnout for non-ballet dancers is not the most terribly important thing, but we definitely don't want to dance tango, for example, pigeon toad or any other dance, except for maybe sometimes in the international standard you need to be pigeon toad, but that's besides the point, plus you might as well know how to do both, even if you are, that's what you specialize in. So, we're going to try again a very similar, uh, very simple exercise um, that we've, we've done before. We're just going to do basically brushing the floor forward, back and side. So, what I'm going to do in order to work on turn a little bit more though, is I'm going to bend my standing knees. So, for example, I'm going to, when I go forward, I'm going to bend my standing knee, side bend, back bend. So my working leg is going to remain straight, my supporting leg is going to bend. So what I'm going to do is I'll just use my hands on my hips or you can use it for balance, whatever, whatever it is that's more comfortable for you. I'm going to start standing my left leg and I'm going to bend it and brush my right foot forward. So when I'm brushing, I'm going to make sure that my, um, my heel is going up, like I am, I'm offering it to you. So my heel is going to go up and then I'm going to brush it back in. Now I'm going to go side with my right foot. And here I'm actually going to keep my, my heel down into the floor. So if you can, if you turn out, this may be a little bit better. Um, think of keeping your little toe on the floor and your heel is coming in front this way. So if my heel is down on the floor like this, I'm going to turn it out this way and then bring it back in. When I'm going back, I'm also going to um, press my heel into the floor. So again, it's coming forward this way. So I'm not going to do this. I'm going to turn out and keep here. I can't really keep my little toe on the floor. So obviously I'm going to lift it up but I do brush my floor for as long as I can with all of my five toes, like we were um, discussing before in a different exercise. Now I'm going to do the same thing standing on my right, so bring the heel up this way. Now up again, forward, or if you can't, just keep it down so that it's not popping up like that. So keep it down, and now when I go back, I'm going to press it into the floor so again it's coming like this and then brush it back in. So I'll try this again, standing on my left, one, two, three, four, five, six, and switch, one, two, three, four, and five, six. And notice that I'm going really slowly. The idea here is not to do it as fast as possible. The idea is that to feel this joint here rotating. When we talk about turnout, by the way, this is important, we don't talk about just turn out your feet. We say turn out your feet, but what we really mean is you're turning out your entire legs, turning at these joints right here. So when I'm going really slowly, I'm feeling this rotation. My joint is going this way, my joint is still going this way, and it's still going this way. So when I'm turning out here, here, and here, it's come, it's going, it's rotating the same direction. Now for me to turn in, it would turn in this way. So I don't want that line, I want this line. So I'm going to turn out slowly one, slowly two, and feel it, for example, especially when I'm going to the side, I can feel this. It's rotating out, and then as I bring it in, it's rotating a little bit back in. And now, same thing here. Rotate out, and bring it back. Switch out, bring it back. Rotate out, bring it back. Rotate out, and bring it back.